Hey Hot Wheels fans, it's Cinecax. Um, originally when I showed you the rooftop race garage I was not going to do an unboxing um, but when I opened the first one um, it was such an interesting design and I liked it that much that uh, I felt that uh, it was worth getting doing an unboxing for. Um, I gave the first one to my son who loves it um, Hopefully I'll have a review coming of that with him in the next week or so. Um, but uh, for right now, we're going to do a quick unboxing and show you what uh, what the rooftop race garage is all about. So, like I said um, in my earlier video, you can pick these up over at Walmart, uh, about 15 bucks, and. Uh, what I've seen them on at two Walmarts is they have um, a special um, like center PDQ for them. Um, so, so basically, you get your instructions, which there's not much. Um, let's see, you get the car. Um, I forget which one it is. Let me take it off the. Uh, there's the car. It's a uh, twin duction, which I do not have. So I throw it on the ground or on the table. Um, you get the actual garage, which is very nice and compact, and you get a small sticker set. So. Um, so basically, I'm not going to put the stickers on there in the video. Um, they're not really going to change this that much. But basically, what you've got is you basically let's see, pull that up and out. This goes down. That's the ramp um, for being able to bring your cars up on. And uh, then over here on this side, you've got your little filling station, you've got your, um, I don't know what the heck you call that, the jack, I guess, to put your car up on so you can work on it, and then I don't know what this device is for. But if you look at the sticker for it, let's see, maybe it's doing some type of pressure thing. I'm not that cool, um, so I don't know. But, so this is basically it. Let me move the camera back a little. Make this a little easier to see. So basically, I think you can see all of that. Let me move my light. Okay, so basically, you put the car back here on the ramp. Then the ramp slides up. And then you tilt it. Um, box in here. This is this part reminds me very much of the six-lane raceway. I think the four-lane raceway is sort of the same thing. Um, and then you cock that, so that locks into place. Um, let me pick a second car. Sure, Camaro. Convenient. So you're all ready to go. And basically, let me, yeah, there we go. So you basically pull that down, cars race, and the uh, flag tilts based off of whoever got through the uh, finish line first. Very simple, very cool. Um, my son loves it. Um, it's become his new favorite thing. It's like I probably could have waited and given it to him to, for Christmas, but... I'm impatient, so, uh, but he loves it, and it's like his new favorite toy, at least for the minute. So, uh, yeah, really cool, um, lots of fun, you know, maybe not the main gift for your, your kid, uh, for Christmas, but as something just really quick to play with and have a good time with, it's wonderful. Um, let me see box. I'm just curious. These are new for 2012. 
They might have come out under a different name before. I'm not sure. Um, the person who would know that would be probably be Race Grooves. <laughs> um, make sure to follow his channel because he's awesome. But I don't know. So, but yeah. So let me just push it forward. And there we go. So that's interesting. That time the uh, it didn't decide on who was the winner, but that's what you get for fifteen dollars. Um, the other one of these sets that they've got over there is called the Super Spin Car Wash. I'll do a separate unboxing of this later um, because I haven't opened one of these yet. Um, fold and go, same as this. But uh, I figured with how much I, me and my son like this one that uh, I'm hoping that the car wash is just as cool. So that's it. Um, other than that, um, I've noticed that besides the wall trucks power drop that I showed you guys uh, this weekend, last week, which is this one, which I still haven't opened yet, um, I saw this other new one. I saw this one tonight called the Switchback Slider. So another little wall track set. These are running for about 12 bucks a piece at Walmart. So. Um, sort of interesting, the two pieces I got, the power drop and then the switchback slider are like these little extension pieces and then you have the auto motion speedway starter set, the spin slammer and the swing arm slide. And those ones I have not seen in the stores yet. I know that Amazon has the swing arm slide and the spin jammer but uh, you know at least they say they do. I haven't tried to buy them yet. So, But yeah, so keep an eye out for that. Um, but, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and have a great night.